going to be an interesting subject. Hey everyone, welcome back to The Scott Barnes Show. And in today's video, we're gonna be covering the topic of arm hair and whether to trim or shave. Now, I bring up this topic because yes, I do trim my arm hair, my leg hair, and I pretty much shave my body. And as we are now into the times of Instagram, YouTube, TikTok, bodybuilding, and everything in between to expose ourselves in the world, masculinity for the men and feminism for the women. I think it's pretty awesome to say that it's okay to stick with the times. Now, if you're like me and every other man in the world, we have a copious amount of arm hair, some more, some less. For me, I lean more towards the Robin Williams side. And when I say that is if I let my arm hair grow out for two or three months, it gets excessive. And that goes for the legs as well. Coming into my fitness realm, I have been gaining weight, I have been gaining muscle, and on top of that, I've been getting some nice lines, some veins, all that good stuff, and the best way to show it off is to either trim or shave up your arms, and or your legs, and your chest, and your back. Yeah, I'm a hairy guy. Now the two things that I wanna cover is either shaving or trimming. Now for me, I like to trim, and there's two reasons why. One, when we shave, possible cuts. All right, that's the first reason why. Number two, ingrown hair, and uh, for me, number three, when your the hair regrows, it's very visible that you you shave your arms and your legs. And I don't know that's borderline to Metro. That's, that's just me. So every month, I just go ahead and get out the hackers. I just go through it. I pick a selected guard on my clippers and I just run through the whole body. Now you have a multiple realm of devices to use. I particularly like the barber style clippers with a long or short guard, depending on how long or short you want your hair. Now, the reason why I don't like to go with Manscaped, and that's obviously what Manscaped does is to clean up your body, it's too small of a width on the clipper. Where if you use a barber size clipper, you're gonna get more surface area. On top of that, my Manscaped dies so quick, and it's because of the size. When you get a bigger clipper like Beardscape, this sucker is crazy and it lasts forever. I don't think I've even charged this thing up one time since I've gotten it, it's still at 70%. But I've noticed with Manscaped, it tends to die pretty quick. And I've noticed too that I have to clean it out a lot more. So if you're deciding to trim up your arm hair, go with something more of a clippers. Now onto the second reason why I actually prefer clipping over shaving is because you're not waiting about two or three weeks for the arm hair to grow back and you don't have to shave every two weeks when the hair starts growing. As we trim, if we only give it about four or five days, the actual hair itself will tip, right? Instead of having a blunt cut, it will tip and you'll have that natural layover on your arm. So what I typically do is I'll shave up here on my shoulder and then I'll fade it into my arm hair because usually I wear a t-shirt instead of tank tops and then I shave everything else. But there is one pro and one con to all of this. And one is I do get some bumps every once in a while. And a couple of reasons why is, yes, I do eat a lot of chocolate. And two, I do sweat a lot. And yeah, my skin is very oily and I just need to start scrubbing and exfoliating a little bit more. But that being said, those can cause those problems as well. But getting down to it, it just depends on what you wanna do. If you wanna trim it, if you wanna shave it, that all comes down to you. But I wanted to bring up the two pros and cons of what works and what's better. These are all personal preferences of mine. But at the end of the day, you know, we're getting into a more metro look in today's society. You know, we got all the lines, we got everything all primped and crew cut it up. And I don't mind it, to be honest with you. And it, when you work hard, you can kind of flaunt it and show it off, right? One thing though to remember is don't let anybody judge you. Yes, they can judge all day long, but don't let it affect you. Because at the end of the day, it's what makes you happy. And this, what I am right now today, makes me very happy. I feel confident within myself. And at the end of the day too, it's all about what's inside. So with that, you guys, I leave you with a great and happy day. Uh, like, subscribe, check me out on all that social media. Love you like always, and I will see you on the flip side. See ya.